Hi, my name is Christian Brown. I'm multimedia editor for Aware. I'm here at Sex Bingo with two people from prison. Um, Hi, I'm Abby Arts. I am the president of Prism here at Rowan University. And I'm Ella Emmer, and I'm secretary for Prism. We are a um, activist um, organization here on campus. We like to advocate, educate, and um, support the LGBT community here. Um, this event, Sex Free Bingo, is I believe this is our fifth annual um, running of this bingo. Um, we have our really awesome sponsor, Fantasy Gifts, um, from Franklinville, New Jersey. They're fantastic. They help hook, hook us up with all these sex toys we have to bingo away. And we collaborate with them to uh, raise funds for the Trevor Project, which is an LGBT uh, suicide prevention hotline, so people who are in crisis can reach out to them for free. So um, all the proceeds from this go to them to help support that. Do you guys ever receive any kind of hate? All the time. Um, the good thing is, though, that Rowan, most of the Rowan University is very supportive, and um, it's very great at helping assist us with uh, navigating the hate mail. Um, at the end of the day, though, we know in our hearts that um, love is love, and that's all that matters and people who are hating, that's on them and reflects their issues and uh, we're here to advocate and educate so and we be can, positive. Yeah, absolutely. And be positive and make sure like sex positivity is something on this campus absolutely. that people are feeling comfortable with their bodies and who they are and that people can come out and learn about consent and learn about safe sex and learn about all kinds of other like sexual health um, information. For a person who may not have come out yet or for a person who recently come out, if they're looking for like a group or anything like that, your club is the perfect sample. How, how, would, how would they find you reach out or what kind of tips would you have for someone who's still in the closet or somebody who may or potentially may come out? We try and keep our community um, at PRISM uh, positive toward people who are in the closet. Um, we have a safe space policy where you are not allowed to out anybody. Um, so we have had plenty of members that come to our meetings who are in the closet and um, I don't think anyone's ever been outed. No. We, um, we take that really seriously because that's someone's life and that's someone's Absolutely. safety and it's extremely serious. And also it's important to know that even if you're not out, you're just as valid in your sexuality and who Absolutely. you are as a human being and you should still be proud because proud doesn't necessarily mean you need to be fully out to the public. It means that you're okay with who you are on the inside and if you're if you're okay with that then no one else needs to know if you're not safe enough to do that right now. And we can celebrate that. Like, yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Yeah. Sorry to ask this, but like an article written by like uh, by uh, the new senator Alex was talking about sexual assault on campus. Like how do you, what's your guys' opinion on that and how can Rowan approve on that? I think sexual assault on campus college campus is such a growing problem and such a huge problem. Um, here at PRISM we like to talk about consent. We have a consent meeting um, where we do an hour to two hour presentation on consent every semester. Uh, we always talk about consent. We use the first 10-15 um, minutes of this bingo to talk about consent and uh, sex safety. Um, I think this campus could do a lot more, but um, I think the Rowan University puts in a lot of effort definitely to keep their students safe, by, especially by allowing us to have fantastic events like this. How long have you guys been doing sex bingo and how was it doing like today? So this is actually my first sex bingo. I put in it until last year, so it was a lot having to never been to one and then having to run it, but everyone's so supportive, everyone's happy to be here. I know Ab is a great president and she's all about building our team up. So it's been incredible. Everyone's out here to have a good time, raise money for the Trevor Project, and it's amazing. Right. So where, where can people attend meetings or come to you guys at? Our meetings they would wish to become a member of our organization and get our weekly emails and updates. They can add. And if you're unable to attend meetings, you can always still come to our events, which you can stay updated through ProfLink or send us an email at uh, rowanprism at gmail.com. Yep. All right, yeah. <laughs>